Don't say that to me. What up? It's your boy T Bear here with some news and reaction. Now, one reason I'm doing news and reaction because it's like low key near and dear in my heart with this situation right here. So, um, sadly, a well known activist of the HIV AIDS, mm -hmm. one of the youngest one at that, by the name of Hydea Broadbent, sadly passed away at age of 39. The reason I say. And the reason why it's near her heart, one, she's close to my age. But for those of you not familiar with her story, though, she was one of the, she was part of, um, she was sadly part of a pandemic where, uh, sadly, babies, uh, were, ba some babies of the 80s were born with the HIV in a the time as well, too. I don't know, it was something due to, uh, Due to his late age, due to like folks born out of uh, late, uh born out of the, those who had AIDS because of the past lifestyle, what was it of the past, what was it from drugs, uh, unprotected sex, and um, or unfortunate blood transfusion as well, too. Though, either way, I wasn't sure why the parents would, but I found out, found out she was she was actually adopted, though, as well, too. Though, so yeah, she was adopted, and um, to your reading, um. For his story was, uh, she was born at age because she has an infant. She was abandoned at a Universal Medical Center in South Nevada, Las Vegas, who died about her parents. Who it was presumed that Broadbent was born HIV, but she was not diagnosed until she was three. Uh, but yeah, initially tag along with her mother, a social worker, as she began speaking publicly about HIV. And reason why it's, it's, my, it's a child as well, it's my, it's, this is like a child to me as well, too. I remember um early nineties, nine ninety two, it was like really after uh Magic Johnson announced his uh him he made the, made the, the announcement. Y'all know what the announcement is as well too about um, transgender HIV. He had a special on Nickelodeon, a Nick News special as well too about that, where um a bunch a bunch of kids including her, including her was diagnosed with HIV or AIDS as well too. I think she was like the youngest at the time as well too. I think she was like. Seven or six on that on the thing as well too. Matter of fact, right right here. Uh, Nick Lloyd special. Um, and um, when she uh made a, st a lot of make statement, and she made a statement about a, st a statement too. Like um, they got it right here in the news feed. I just want people to know that we're just normal people. And um, she started crying. And it's not this picture. The picture you see right here is not from there. This is actually from she, she was a little bit older on the Oprah Ripley show as well too, and she brought and I don't think I saw that one, but I heard that she brought uh, Oprah to tears. Um, but yeah, ever since then, the reason why I fall I ended up falling back up to her because they had a uh, special, I think a thirty for thirty about the announcement of Magic Johnson and they mentioned about the, the the Nickelodeon special he had as well too on Nick News, and at the end. They did a follow on her, and surprisingly, she was alive and well, live and still doing her thing as an activist as well too. And like, this was one time she was in her twenties. So, um, look at a picture to use for her for um to talk about the situation about her sadly passing away. Come to find out that recently she was on life support as well too. That her complication, her um, her uh, situation with having AIDS and HIV, AIDS and HIV. Got to her severely though, and sadly, um, she's no longer with us. But the fact that she lived up to thirty nine was a blessing. The fact she lived long enough was a blessing as well too, because the kids she probably with the kids she's probably with on that special, some of them probably passed way before her, even at the around not too long from that. Um, you know the story about this uh the kid that uh Michael Jackson did a song uh, called to Sue about as well too. He got his do it blood transfusion and sadly passed not too long after. Um and you know, she lived longer she lived long enough and there's probably some who li just live who may have lived just as long as her before fortunately it got to him and might be some that's still living. Hey, it might be a very little who might got cured. Who knows? Either way, uh, it's a sad but bad but a blessing at the same time that she passed at the age of thirty nine. A little shy away from turning forty, she would have been forty in June. But um, 
But for what she went through, she definitely lived a good life as well too. And she, the fact that she spread her, spread awareness to it, um, as 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 started at an age, a young age as well too, and it continued on till now. Um, she passed away, by the way, um, yesterday as well too. So yeah. Um, but um, other than that, RP to a very beautiful soul, um, as well too. That um went through a lot, but was a blessed to others as well too. Was going through what she was going through, so I paid to idea brought it and prayers out to her family, especially her mother who was very supportive. Her adopted mother who was very supportive of her as well too, and anybody else who's dealing with HIV and AIDS as well too. They still going on and still going on these to this day. So other than that, um yeah, the pandemic. Really big, came big around the eighties, which um, ended up um, even uh, you know, got got dealt with, and dealt with a lot of celebrities, including Matt Johnson, some who know sadly no longer with us as well too. Not Matt Johnson, but other celebrities as well too. But yeah, this was had a uh, highlight this because, like I said, this was I remember watching this special as a kid as well too, and then hearing her story follow up after when Magic dropped the uh, thirty for thirty about the uh, announcement. As well too, and um, I think I actually I don't know I saw it saw the Oprah, but um, I remember heard about her being Oprah and now I actually brought Oprah the tears over her story as well too. But other than that, um, R.I.P. to a beautiful soul of Hadia, Hadia Broadbent, um, and she will T. Breast signing off one love.